order to get Office 365 connected to your version of Outlook on a Windows computer, we will do the following. Click on the Start button. If you're running Windows 7, you can just click on the Control Panel link on the right side. If you are running Windows 10, you are going to need to search for it. So once you've opened up the Start menu, type Control. You will find it at the top of the list here. Click on Control. Once you're there in the Control Panel dialog, we're going to the Search Control Panel in the upper right, and we're going to type the word Mail, M-A-I-L. It will find the Outlook connector already installed on your computer. Click on that. That will open up the Mail Setup Outlook dialog. We're going to click on the Profiles, Show Profiles dot 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 button. Once we are there, we're going to click on the Add because we're going to add a new account. So clicked on the Add button. And now I'm going to call the profile name Office 365. Once the Add Account dialog shows up, I can give it what I want. I'm going to use this account. I'm going to type in the password. It's going to search for the settings online. It should find them because Office 365 works quite well with the newer versions of Outlook. And as you can see, it's finished on my machine. I'm going to finish. And then I'm still looking at the mail dialog window here. And I'm going to set the new Office 365 profile as the default. So I'm going to click on the radio button that says always use this profile. And then I'm going to click on the link here to show me the, the two choices. I'm going to click on Office 365. And then I'm going to click OK. Now I can start Outlook, and it should connect for the first time to that Office 365 account. And depending upon the speed of your machine and your connection to the internet, this could be a lengthy process or it could be very quick. It also depends on how much stuff, email messages, contacts, calendar items have already been preloaded into Office 365. You can see here it's, it's done and I could now use Outlook.